Hello, we got ourselves some 1251 Scotch Bonnet Jam from the awesome people at Salt Shop. <laughs> Twelve Fifty One Jam um, is designed by a guy called James Cochrane. Now he won uh, the Great British Menu, I think. Yeah. Correctly. So, and, and if I remember rightly, Twelve Fifty One is actually his restaurant. Oh, okay. Know. Okay. All right. Cool. Well, the um, ingredients on your screen. What attracted us to this is the fact they're using charred Scotch bonnets. Yeah. That's a nice touch. Nice touch. Bring out the sugars. Bring out the flavour of the Scotch bonnet. So. Um, there's not a lot else going on there, really, is there? No. It's pretty, pretty straightforward stuff. Uh, so. As you can see from the, the ingredients. Mm, yeah. So we've um, we're both big fans of sweet and salty together. So we've actually put it in a bacon sandwich. So as you can see on your screen, it's it's just yeah, literally bacon, nice bread, a bit of butter, of course, and uh, this jam. So that for us is the way we're going to try it. We might try a bit off the spoon in a minute as well, yeah. I think. But let's let's give it a go because. Oh, dude, Scotch bonnet in the jam is fantastic. Again, I'm not one of those people that needs like a chili jam too hot. I don't know about you. No. Um, but I do want a bit of heat and a bit of flavour. So I'm expecting, yeah, well, it's come from a chef. So I'm expecting these Scotch bonnet flavours to come through. Um, and yeah, a nice balanced sweetness, not overly yeah. sweet. Because um, a lot of chili jams on the market can be a little bit too too much. So, all right, should we give it a go? Have a blast, see how we get on. Yeah. All right. Mm. Don't judge me on how I eat a sandwich. Okay. Mmm. Oh, yeah, it's got a bonnet flavour. Yeah. Do you ever? And there's a nice amount of heat there, isn't it? Which is uh, overpowering <laughs> for the food. It, it is. It's a good. That's lovely, yeah. yeah. Even level. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Yeah, that the um, special bacon as well, mm -hmm. chili lamb bacon, all day long. Um, yeah, it's nice. It's nice balance. It's balanced sugar. It's balanced acidity. Um, Scotch bonnet is not lost at all, no. which is great. Um, I like the viscosity of it as well. Yeah. It's not a set jam, um, and I'm a big fan of things like that. A lot more usable when they're set. Otherwise, you've got to warm them through and kind of yeah. So for me, that's a really nice touch. Mm -hmm. Yeah, to tell you the truth, I'd have that with that like uh, halloumi fries. Oh hell yeah! Like no, um, add the dip in. Like, it just smells divine. I think it's a bit tomato. Is there tomato in there? It smells like a little yeah. bit. There is a bit. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna try a little bit of the spoon. Do you want me? Yeah, go on. Yeah, give it a go. Hmm. Yeah, viscosity is lovely. Texture is really nice. Mm. A little charred flex in there as well, which I quite like seeing. Yeah, so it's, it's a nice mixture of the, the flavour of the Scotch bonnet and, and the tomatoiness, which almost makes it taste slightly like a, a, a relish rather than a, mm. a jam, which is why it works really well to do stuff like the bacon sandwiches. Yeah, I think that's bang on, isn't it? Um, that's, that's a really nice product. Yeah. I think it's one of the better chilli jams I've tried in a long time. So. Uh, well done between well uh, James and, and Sauce Shop guys. Uh, you obviously got that one on the money, so well done to you indeed. Um, heat wise, at a ten, uh, I'd give it probably maybe a six. Yeah, I think so too. It's there is enough heat to satisfy most chili heads. Uh, it isn't commanding yeah. as such. It's not. It's not overtaking, which is great. Which you don't want. Um, it works brilliantly in this kind of thing. Uh, so. I'd be happy to be using that as like a glaze and a finishing sauce, um, quite, quite, quite happily. Uh, would you buy it again? Yes. Hell uh, yeah. yeah, yeah, absolutely. It's a spot on, spot on product that. So that's, I don't do much of sweet stuff personally, but actually something like that would, would quite happily sit in my, um, not for long, but happily sit in my <laughs> cupboard and that's that. So, okay, if you want to try something like this, feel free to check out Soul Shop. They do some great products actually. Uh, they're quite simplistic products, which is a very good thing. So it, it really just kind of like, Mainly, a lot of their sources were just all about the pepper, which I really, yeah. really appreciate. 
Uh, so do check them out. But if you want to try yourself a good chili jam, then this actually I, I thoroughly recommend. So yeah, give them a go. Um, yeah, anything more you want to add? No, no. no. Let's, uh, let's get some bacon down as I think. So, all right. Thank you so much for watching. As always, please feel free to share, subscribe, um, leave comments for any ideas that I see you want us to do, anything you want us to try. You know, we're all we're all ears. Um, and hopefully, we'll see you on another video real soon. Bye for now. Bye.